Welcome to TMJ News. Matrix style. Intro. Hello. Welcome. That intro was in slow motion because it was Matrix. Right. We're talking about summer movies. Summer movies. Well, actually, not summer movies, but movies coming out this year. Number one, I Frankenstein. That's already out. Yeah, I know, but it's movies that are out. Oh, uh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's cool. Yeah. So movies that have come out this year. And also are going to come out. These are ones we, like, uh, know of at the moment. But uh, we, if we miss any out, put it in the comments and we'll do another episode. I'm um, TP Gamesit, by the way. He's I'm TP. Not part, I'm, I'm not He's part, not part of Team Joe. He's I'm, not Joe. I'm, he's not the best called Joe you've been waiting for. Or Tom. He's coming. Oh, no, I'm not all Toby. Okay. No, he's... He, we know Toby. Toby, we've seen Toby. Yeah. This is Tom. He's he's a friend of mine. Right. I'm, I'm Frankenstein. Really? The, the book's good. The book. I like. I I like the idea of Frankenstein. The original movie's okay. Yeah. yeah. I wish they'd done a remake of the movie, the original book, before they made a remake with Holden Morley. You've got gargles that turn into Romans. That's I know Romans are cool, but why would a gar- wouldn't a gargle turn into an emo or something? A Greek. Yeah, it was a part Or what about, like, an emo? It turn into an emo or something, because emos love gargles. Yeah! Or, like, a priest. Cause I'm not an emo. I'm definitely not, I'm not an emo. He's not an emo. <laughs> um... I'm yeah. just too full of joy to be an emo. Uh, and then Frankenstein's just a bit like, yeah, you know, it's like they're, they're that, uh, it's gonna be like a couple of references to the book, but I wish oh. there's more. And it's also it's I Frankenstein, but, um, but, but, Frankenstein, but Frankenstein, Frankenstein isn't the monster. Frankenstein's a scientist. Ooh, I hate when people make that mistake. Uh, right. Maybe. So yeah. should you see this movie? Well, we've got. The dice of destiny. The, the dice of destiny. Dice of destiny. Let's see what we've got. Blow into, blow into my hand. There we go. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe you should see this movie. It's rigged. It's rigged. No, it isn't. <laughs> okay, we'll be back with the Legends of Hercules. TMJ <laughs> News. <laughs> Today we're talking about three Spartacus. No, 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 the Legend of Hercules. Oh yes, the Legend of Hercules. Oh yeah, I've chipped hair then. Ditch, ditch, yeah. Slow motion fighting into the camera. Okay, right. Okay. So we are talking about the head. Well, for me, anyway, the legend. It's uh, awesome. The trailer has dubstep in. Dubstep. It's awesome. awesome. It's all about, like, a kind of a true story. Uh, well, no, Hercules is, is, a, is, is a myth. It's Roman, I think. Or is it Roman or Greek? I don't know. I think it's put in the Greek. comments. It's Greek. I think it's Greek. Yeah, it's Greek. <laughs> okay, put in the comments if we're right. Uh, I think it is. That's what you do if you don't know something on YouTube. You just ask them to put it in the comments. It's yeah. Greek. Oh, well, well basically, they... basically, it tells a story about a Greek man. A Greek. A he's like a demigod. Yeah. He. Yeah, he. You keep talking. He knows the laws of his people. And then. He's well. The Romans sent. I don't know why, but the Romans send him to. It's he's, no, it's because um they were gonna marry to connect two families together. They were gonna marry someone, but he was in love with the princess who they were gonna mix families with. Yeah. Uh, and so then he got. They knew this, so they exiled him to. So, uh, um. So the Romans. Egypt. So the Romans exiled him to. It was Egypt. Greek, I thought. Uh, no, he's Greek, but the Romans exiled him to Egypt on the front lines. But then he comes <laughs> back to. He comes back to wherever he right, comes from to avenge well, himself, really. Yeah, and also in like the opening sequence, he like he's like a gladiator, basically. Um, yeah, he's a gladiator. So next, would you want to see this movie? Yes. I want to see this movie. You see, we've got so many history like action movies that are so awesome. Let's do the dust. The, the dice of destiny. Well, we say yeah, you should you should definitely see this movie, but the dice of destiny will decide your fate. No, I'm not just mine. It actually says yes. Hell yes. 
Hell yeah! Hercules is like he, in the he's box. Awesome. He's hopeless, but mm. the movie looks awesome. Well, no, because they have to make him look awesome. Because how boring would it be? Like a spotty nerd. Everyone's <laughs> <laughs> like, ah, I'm gonna kill his enemies. Like the guy in 300. What? Like the guy with. The, I think our next movie should be talking about 300. Rise right. of the Empire. Lego movie. We have to talk about. Oh Lego. my god! Even though it's. It's been up for ages. The review, we have, we, we have to do the review on the Lego We'll try not to spoil anything. Green Lantern. Orange Lantern. Orange so basically, if you don't want to know anything about the Lego movie at all before you watch it, don't watch it next week. And if you haven't seen it. But we won't spoil anything really. We'll just talk about the main, you know, well, the characters in it and how it helps for you. Hello and welcome back. Thomas? Yes? <laughs> And uh, we've got someone to talk to you. I'm Batman. But I may not be the Batman from the Batman Lego movie because I'm from the Lego game. But I wear a headband, so I don't know how I see because my headband is in the ice lot. Anyway, oh my god. My head is in the way of everyone. I'm being such a douche. You're here, you're always just a douche. Where's Rachel? Rachel! <sighs> Right, so yeah, the Lego Movie. Batman <gasps> is the Lego Movie. There's only one more we can say about it. Awesome. Uh, Everything is cool when you're part of a team. Everything is awesome when you're living a dream. Right, this movie's got loads of characters. We've got Emmett, the number one fitting in builder. No business. He's got T. Fiery, fiery T. Mm -hmm. We've got Pack Up and Good Cop. Double sided head. He's really nice, but then we lose Good Cop and everyone's sad. We've got Bar Style. She's really hot. <laughs> Batman, but he's Batman's girlfriend. But Emmett loves her. Batman doesn't know who Lucy is. Who's Lucy? Lucy is. Wild style. That was the no lap. Do do do. There's metal beard. He's a pirate. There's a shark on his arm. Yeah. There's also random space guy. Danny. Danny, the space guy. Right. Oh, let's see. Right. Right. Let's see. Right. Let's talk about. Legendary. Right. Awesome. I think they should do a sequel. They could totally do a sequel with the Jubilee, but. They could ruin it. I do think the the the, the sequel won't be as good because normally oh sequels. God, are. it's so for a Lego movie. It's like, God, if people are. Oh, my parents are like, oh no, it's too babyish. No, it's not. I'm just editing the focus of the camera, so now it's it's better. Yeah, Matt, should we mm. need to talk about Lego movie? Lego movie. Yeah, so, what's the main plot? Don't ruin it all. Just talk about like just um, just talk into well, little, little detail. We have Emmett. I'm a builder. Builder. He falls in a hole and sees this weird red thing. Called the... I The root piece of resistance. Oh, yes, there you go. Sounds very French. Oh. Oh. He judges it, even though he's not meant to. So he disobeyed the rules. But then Wildstar takes him and they get chased by some cops all across this crazy universe. Good job! And then Bird they they talk in uh, this crazy weird land of Unity. Why are we Why you have? Yeah, they go to all sorts of places. There's the wild then ones. They all get captured and they to build all these fig to build all these buildings, right? He has instructions and he's using all the master builders that these famous characters but Flash, imagination. Superman, yeah. Green Lantern, Batman, and anybody. No, even, even not even superhero. Even Abraham Lincoln. Yes. And they all get captured. Emmett, they say, is the chosen one. He's meant to like save the land. Um, and he's dropped up to a battery, going to electrocute everyone. But he sacrifices himself and goes down the hole of never ending. And then something. Amazing happens now. Tom, get that dice now. I'll get it. Tom, you carry on talking about the Lego movie. Don't tell them about what happens when he falls down the hole. Oh yeah. The don't don't say that. Oh yeah. So That's okay. a big spoiler. That's a big big spoiler. Right. So after the fall down the hole bit, I can't tell after that. But then what about? But then it all goes happily ever after later. Then but then then. True plot. Then Lord Business has invaded mm. Bricksburg. Which is the city where Emmett lives, and then all the people have to build trucks. There's a flying ice cream that flies out. Yeah. Right. So, before we spoil anymore, 
It is. Awesome. The dice of destiny. We just say yes. We don't. Even, I don't even think we need to throw the this. The best movie ever. Um, let's roll it. It says no. Right, no, no. Don't listen it's to rigged. it. It's rigged. It's rigged. That is the fake one. Right, right. Let's do another roll. Maybe. Ah! We didn't blow on it. I don't. Maybe you might. No. Why don't you blow it? No, no, no. Oh. no epic summer, I think. I don't. Put it down, put it down. 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 We're back three hundred rise of an empire. It's back for the three hundredth episode. In the three hundredth episode, we will talk about this. We'll talk about it again. Yeah, three hundredth episode. Matthew Madness. and Thomas Birch. We we'll get Thomas Birch in. Because okay, I love three hundred. I've watched every. I've, I've watched the first one like every. all three. The difference. All you need to know is three hundred on a boat. So it's epic land slow mo fire. Remember. So actually, no, it's boat fighting. Cause most of it actually. But, yeah, so like boat fighting. Like, yeah. Swords. Boat. But you probably think some swords. people have probably seen it. Um, it's not out yet. Really? No. So it was. No, um, I think I don't know. I'm no. sure it's out. I'm sure I've seen it. Real. Well, if it is out, tell us because we're, we're put it in the comments. We're idiots. We're adding loads of comments asking things. We are. We are. We are going to forget what they're doing. We are idiots. Um, so badly. Yeah. Yeah, looks awesome. So it's basically the sequel to the 300. So if you've seen 300 the movie, at the end you all know all the guys die. Yeah, including Leonidas. You know the king of Sparta. Yeah. So it's his son. Yeah, his mm -hmm. son. Who's like older now? He's like makes a pledge to his mother. So he will avenge his father. And he makes a deal with this woman who's got a navy, and she sold her soul to the devil. Yeah, and then and then and then. He fights the Persian Navy, who's, who has more than, let's say, more ships than they do. So they are serious. This reminds me of something where there's more soldiers. Where's something like 300 soldiers? Are there 300 boats? <laughs> if they do 300 boats, it's going to be a bit of a day job. Oh my god, they've got 300 boats. No. Or is it going to be a little decrepit boat? <laughs> <laughs> if you know what that is, put it in the comments. Oh my god. Okay. Right. We think you should go to see this if it's already out. Uh, Destiny Cube. What's Destiny Cube? Uh, I don't know. Where is it? I put it down here somewhere. Cube of Destiny. Did it fall down again? Uh, I'll check. Tom, carry on top. Yeah. Uh, 300 Rise of an Empire is back. So it's all about... It's all about the Spartans taking about their homeland. Because, you know, as you know, if you know, if you know history... Oh, and if you know... If you know your history... And or you, just, or you just watch the movie. Spy gets taken over by the Persians. The second. So this one is all talking about <laughs> taking over from out the Persians. <laughs> so I'm gonna roll the dice of destiny. No, no, yeah. Yes, I am. No, it's well, not. Okay, no, I, I, I'll give my, I'll, I'll give my. Um, well, my opinion is it's gonna be awesome. I've seen the land, the slow mo fighting is awesome on land. Oh. It's gonna be even epic on sea. My opinion is you should definitely go see 300 Rise of an Empire. It's from the director of 300 and Man of Steel. So, ow! Ow! He just kicked me in the back. Oh, so, it has to be awesome. Now, you better hurry up or I'm not going to roll the dice of destiny. All of the things we've reviewed, we said you should watch. Because, mommy, movies coming out are awesome. Also, Guardian of the Galaxy, we'll quickly say. What's going on with the Galaxy? It's quite cool, actually. You probably see it. Right, we'll do a dice for 300 and Garden of Galaxy, even though Garden of Galaxy we're not going to do a review for. Cause, right. Well, I was oh, this is the TMJ thing that you're going to win. It's that. It's the other way around because of camera. But then back there, you can have your initials. Roll the destiny. Do you want to spin it for 300? Yeah. I'll do a Garden of Galaxy. Because I love 300. Right, let's see what, it, what, let's see what the dice of destiny is. Hold on. <laughs> yeah! Reggie says it's not rigged! It's not rigged. 